it's Liz from Little Hope Sit on the Hill and today I thought I would show you my thrifty finds, so stay tuned. Like I said, I went to the thrift stores this week. I love my thrift stores. I have two normal thrift stores in town. One's called the Doggy Bag, and the other one is called This and That. And then there's also Goodwill, so, which is, eh. I go there every once in a while. I don't really find too much there because they are so expensive compared to like the other thrift stores that I do go to. But that's okay. So I did find a couple things at all of them, so I thought I'd show you guys what I bought. So the first thing I got at the Doggy Bag store is I got this little jar, which I'm excited. I love these jars so much. They are awesome. So. And then I got a candle for $1.50. It's brand new, never been used. And honestly, this is my favorite scent. So when I saw this, I was very excited. So this is their Cranberry um, Mandarin Splash Candle. So good. And then I got this little Yankee candle right here. I think I paid 10 cents for it because the wick is not in there, but I can fix this very easily. I can melt this down and make a brand new cat candle out of it. Let's see, what else did I get from that store? I got a cookbook called 30 Vegetable Juices. These are all a dollar each. Um, my husband loves to um, juice. And we're always looking for new recipes, so this is awesome. And then I also got Mom's Big Book of Baking. And if anybody knows me, I love to bake. So this is so exciting for me. And then I got Grandmother's Kitchen Wisdom Book. And this was also a dollar. Um, this is over 600 solutions to common kitchen problems. So it has like, let's see stain removal how to do cold storage um let's see the cheese and it's just um cold and freezer facts you name it it's it's got it in this book so i'm very excited for that and the next thing i got at the freaky dexter was this little girl no i'm just kidding this is dot dot were you for sale were you for sale huh okay <laughs> So that was it. I also got this at the store. It's just like a big wooden bowl and it was actually um, half off. So it was a dollar and it came with a little fork. So you can always use these. That was it from that store too. And I will roll the clip of me purchasing these items at this thrift store. So it is right here.
And then at the next thrift store I went to is called This and That. And I got these really cute little stickers. They're like little barnyards and stuff. They're really cute. So, thought, why not? <laughs> and then I got some more stickers right here. Aren't those adorable? And they're on the back, too. I love these. They're so cute. And then I got um, some little rattles. And I like to give these to my bird. I have a big old cockatoo and he loves playing with baby toys and they're so much cheaper than buying the $50 toys that you would buy at like you know at Petco and stuff so we just make our own and then she also the lady <laughs> gave me all these balls for him right here because he loves to chew on things so I have more I have a lot of balls but she gave me six of them for free for him. So I was very excited for that. And he will love these so much. And I think the pug likes them too. You like these, that, that? And what else did I get from this one? I got another cookbook for a dollar. It's called Great Cakes, Pies, Cookbooks, and Muffins, and more. So I got this one. And I also got... Gooseberries Patch Homestyle Family Favorites. I love Gooseberry Patch um, cookbooks. They're really good. They're simple. They're easy. They're awesome. And at Goodwill, I didn't buy much at Goodwill. I found two mason jars. I am always on the hunt for mason jars. They were used at 99 cents a piece. I kind of thought that was a little expensive, but it's Goodwill. So I think these are going to be like 50 cents to maybe a quarter a piece, but I still got them because I need them. And then I got a book of chakras. So to read up on that. And then I got another book. This reminded me of like a 1950s book. It's called Double Delicious, Good Simple Food, Busy Complicated Lives right here. So my whole haul cost me, let's see, I think it was like $15. You can't beat that. And I love going to the thrift stores probably every two weeks or so because they don't change that much but sometimes there's some really great buys and I love love buying cookbooks they're so much fun well I hope you guys like this video I will see you guys in my next bye